Hey guys, how's it going? It's Agent Xander here, and I'm playing Lord of the Rings War in the North with you guys. New game. Uh, well, it's not a new release game, but it's an, <laughs> a new game that I'm playing for you. Um, this came out a while ago, and I never picked it up, because uh, I heard a lot of mixed reviews, but I decided I'd get it, because I, like I liked all the Lord of the Rings games on the Xbox. There was one that I just played all the time the uh, ex original Xbox. Um, so I thought I'd try this out, you know, see for myself. Um, I guess I just pick one of these. I guess it's like Warrior, Mage, Ranger. I'm gonna go with the Ranger. Uh, yeah, let's do it. When I saw stuff about this game, I thought it looked really, really good, but then I waited for a while after it came out, and a lot of people said it was good, a lot of people said it was bad. I didn't know what to think, so I just never got it. But we'll find out now. I guess. That's a cool loading screen. It'd be cool if you could move it around, though, instead of it just... Drifting on its own. Of the great war of the ring, Gandalf. many songs have been sung and many tales told. The names of heroes like Gandalf the Grey, Aragorn the King, and Frodo the Ring Bearer are greatly revered, and rightly so. Yet Sauron's grasp stretched much further than the lands of Gondor and Rohan alone. And his forces might have done great evil in the north of Middle Earth had a handful hey, of heroes three. not stood in his path. That's me on the left. Their stories too deserve to be told. Do it. Let's Pay heed now to it. one such tale, which begins here in the town of Bree, just Bree. a few short days before Frodo arrived on his quest. Okay, so it's in the same timeline as the the Fellowship. It's kind of like Aragorn. the game. Ooh, oh, wait. oh, it's well him. met. That guy. And in company with Andriel of Rivendell and Farin of Erebor. An unlikely trio to find walking through the doors of the Prancing Pony. You were at Sarn Ford last I knew. Do you hear yeah, news from Harbalad? Uh, yes. Yes. Grim news. I feared it would be so. Quickly, tell me what has happened, but keep your voices low. There are unfriendly ears, even here in Bree. Three days passed. The guard at Son Ford was attacked by nine black riders. Nine of them? It actually, it does seem like a lot. Stand fast, Rangers! Oh, big. Yeah, he owned <laughs> We were overwhelmed, and the enemy passed into the Shire. This is worse than I imagined. I know these riders. It is from Mordor they come. Mordor. Oh, that was cool. Our folk could not hope to stand against the Nine together. How bad were our losses? Very bad. We tried to resist them, but they were surrounded by an aura of unnatural dread. There is more you should know. After the rout, one of the Black Riders met with an ally, a man of great malice and power. Who was it? Tell me who it was. Dang. It's like a more... More humanoid Black Rider. As a master commander, I have stirred up the orcs of the mountains. Even now, I have a force gathering amid the ruins of old Fornost. These guys around him don't look like orcs. And prepare your forces. We will have need of them soon. My orcs will be ready. These look lands like have known peace for too long. They will soon feel the Dark Lord's wrath. Who, Voldemort? That's what I'm playing, right? Harry po No, it's not Harry Potter? Alright. If this Agandauer has a force at Fornost, then our position grows all the more desperate. Uh. But oh, why all this me? force against the peaceful halflings? It can't be the enemy sees them as a threat. I will say this much. There is a hobbit of the Shire who should be coming this way with a great burden. 
If it falls into the hands of the enemy, it will mean doom for us all. His mouth now moves really is funny. Now on the road with enemies all around. I must find him I don't know. I, I can't explain and it. I need you to help me keep him safe. <laughs> you are my chieftain. I will gladly do that whatever like, you um, command. I, I'm a part uh, of this I can't remember well. his name. The guy who plays Thor. We three are of one Chris. Mind. How can we aid you? No, I don't know. We must reduce the threat from the enemies gathered at Fornost. Travel there and do whatever you can to keep the enemy's eye turned towards you and video. away from the Shire. Perhaps we will have help in this task. Eladan and Elro here were in the north when last I heard. Any gathering of the enemy is certain to attract their attention. Good. You can find no better allies than the sons of Elrond half-elven. I hope we meet. But with or without help, the enemy will be kept busy. We'll make sure of that. Yeah, we will. <laughs> Sniff. Sniff. Sweet, I can move. Holy cow. I spin around really fast. <laughs> move, move, move. Uh, get in the fire. Uh, Warm the buns. Uh, Alright, who are you? Welcome to Bree. You're a stranger around here. May I ask you a few questions? Uh, if you wish. If it doesn't take too long. What sort of questions? We hear a lot of talk from travelers these days. Most of them speak of war and of a growing shadow in the east. The townsfolk just dismiss this. Say it's far away and doesn't concern us. Um. But I'm not so sure. You've traveled. Maybe seen a few things. What's your opinion? Should we be worried? I don't want to make him freak out. The danger is real, but there are those who will do all they can to defend you. Like me. I know we have our defenders, but I fear they are too few. It's time okay. this town took some hand in its own defense. Do it. There is Why not? wisdom in your words. But do others share your concerns? Very few. Most seem to feel that bad things could never happen. Well, here. that's just not true. I'm afraid I'll have to act alone for now. Oh, no. Ooh, that's... What okay. do you intend to it's do? not that good. I'd like to arrange for arming the town. We'll need more than pitchforks if we're forced to defend ourselves. I tried to convince Stupid the dwarven dwarves. merchant to bring us weapons, but he refused. All right, I I'll get you Perhaps some weapons. I should talk to him. It's worth a try. His name is Groff. Groff. He's selling his wares from a market stall down the street. I will let you know. All right. Coming for you, Groff. Uh, what is this? What are you? Bree is a pleasant enough oh. place, but the huh? people here mistrust my kind. Is that my inner thoughts, or is that somebody else? All right, well, I'm going outside. Forewarned is forearmed. Can I ride you? Nope. This reminds me of um, Baldur's Gate Dark Alliance a little bit. Just a little bit, though. Are you Groff? No, you're not a dwarf. Are you? No, Elmund. Come for you, Groff, as soon as I find out how to get to you. Uh, side quest. Yeah. Where's my map? That's not my map. Oh, there it was. That's not helpful. <laughs> Can I? No, I'd like to zoom in, please. Bree. No, I can't. There's really no mini map. All right. That's upsetting. Time to find Groff. Are you Groff? You're a hobbitses. I think he said he had a street uh, stall thing. Are you Groff up there? Are you Groff? You look like you might be Groff. Hey, buddy, how's it going, Groff? Well, now, if you don't mind my saying so, you don't look much like a Breelander. Is there something I can do for you? I need a favor. I have a favor to ask of you. I'm oh, sorry, I'm more pusty. What sort of favor? Uh, strawberry. Oh, favor, not flavor. Okay. I would like you to bring a store <laughs> of weapons to sell to the Bree folk. <laughs> You're pulling my beard. 
I wish that beard is luxurious. I would lick that beard. No, I wouldn't. <clears throat> They may have had no need of weapons in the past. My hair is so shiny. Unsettling times. They and his is so not themselves. shiny. I'll not deny Maybe he's standing under a right. canopy. There's trouble all around. But you'll never get these folks to believe it. Life's been too easy for them. Not everyone is blind to the growing threat. It was one of the townsmen who sent me to... You tell him, Ered Dan. Ered Don. Well. It'll take more than a few sensible folk to make it worth my time. These people are simple and peace-loving. I'm gonna keep on trying. I'm not giving up. Prevent them from preparing for their future. Mm. You're right, of course. Maybe it's not such a bad idea after all. At least I Do have it. no competition. Oh. Excellent. I will let them know of your decision. Safe travels, Groff. Uh. Where did I come from? I thought it was right around here, but. This, this is where I was. This doesn't look like the inn, though. Maybe, oh, it's right here. That's right. Hello? Who was I talking to? Dude by the fire. Whoop. I got you some did weapons, you man. What did he say? Will he bring us weapons? He will. I managed to convince him. You will have your arms. Excellent. My only concern now is the time it will take. What if we need um, to defend it? How, how can so? I help you, sir? I can tell by your gear that you are no stranger to a fight. If you should have occasion to, well, let's say, recover any weapons you don't need, uh, okay. bring them. Cool. I will bear that in mind. Farewell. Sure thing, buddy. Now, where am I going? I know I'm going to a different city. I really wish there was a mini map of some kind. There's gotta be. Oh! I did. Oh, where'd it go? Why would it not just stay up? I have to hold it right now. Holding the right stick for that to stay up. Come back. Huh, alright. I'm sure there's more side quests here, but I'm just gonna go through the main story. Proceed. For Nost. Sure. It's a pretty epic picture you have there. It doesn't look like my character's in it, though. That looks like the dwarf on the left, the mage lady in the middle, and then some black haired gentleman on the right. Ooh, that's a cool city. This is foremost, yet I see no sign of the enemy. These ruins could hide a large army. We might even now be under the gaze of unfriendly eyes. Like the crows. Well, we came to provide a distraction for <laughs> Aragorn, and what better way to do that than walking in the front door? Okay. Let's be about it. Oh yeah, I forgot I was talking about it earlier. Um, this game seems a lot like the game that I played a lot on the original Xbox. I think it was... Lord of the Rings, the Third Age. You were, it was uh, you were in a little party that was following just behind the Fellowship, um, and you had people in your party that were like almost exactly like the people in the Fellowship. But it was really really fun. It was kind of like this, except instead of wow, I don't okay. Um, instead of whacking combat like this, you would like run into an enemy and then it would transition to a turn-based style combat. So I'll, I'll see which one I like better, but that one was really fun. And it was multiplayer, I think. Like only one person would walk around, but if any other people were playing, they could control people during the fights, which was pretty cool. Oh, bad guys, I'm sorry. Ooh. How do I block? I did it early. Oh, snap. That's helpful. Get owned. Oh, that's sick. I was wondering why I was fighting with the sword. I knew I was the ranger. Oh, in the face! I think he's dead. Cool, it picks stuff up automatically. Anybody in here? 
I'm gonna break all your things. Here we go. That's what you get. Proceed. That just seems like it should be, you should be able to just walk up there. I guess it's a cutscene. Oh, can I zoom in? Yeah. Oh, that was sick. Get it in the face. Can I get you in? Can I get you in the face? <laughs> yes. Okay. Oh, I got him in the side of the head. I think that one hit him in the hand. Oh. Oh, there's more people. There's a lot of guys. You okay, Meiji lady? Oh, I just shot her. No. Okay. I think I shot through her, actually. That's helpful. Can't take much more. Ooh. I hope I don't have a limited number of arrows. Because I'm just chucking these things. I'm like legless right now. Oh, he's dead. Okay. Can I pick up arrows that I shot into people by any chance? Oh, I do have a limited amount of arrows. Dang it. Okay, where's that coming from? Oh. This is awesome. I really like this so far. Move out of my way. I guess he's dead. I'm gonna go break these. Where's our teammate? We're getting overrun. Ah, oh, he's just breaking boxes in the corner. <laughs> Got some boots. No, okay. I think I already picked it up. These guys just keep on coming. Whoop. Got him. I have no oh, I have no more. Wow, I ran out fast. Ooh. Oh, I missed my heavy strike. Oh, <laughs> get on. Can I crouch? Oh. Wanted to teabag him. I guess not. I blocked earlier. How did I? Oh, there we go. Hold on. Oop. There we go. I can roll. I was hoping I could. I had a, a dodging maneuver. Oops. <laughs> okay. I keep pulling right trigger to attack because that's what you use for the bow, but when you're using just the sword, it's X and Y. Ooh, Do I have abilities or anything? Maybe I have combos. Oh, sick. I feel so awesome. Let me help you out there, dwarf man. Oh. Is that it? Where do we go? Whoa. Congratulations, you gained a level. What? I guess I picked that up. Oh, two coins. Oh yeah, I just said click right stick for point of interest. So that's where I'm going. Anything over here? I can't get up there. Okay. Rolling, rolling, rolling. This reminds me a little bit. It's like a mix of Dragon Age and Dark Souls and the, ooh, yeah. and the old Lord of the Rings game I played. Okay, I will find a way out of these pits in the next episode. Um, leave a like if you enjoy. Comment. And let me know if you want me to keep playing this. If nobody likes it, then I'll play it on my own, I, I guess. <laughs> Alright, see you later, guys.